Hello again and welcome to another unboxing video. This time it's, I suppose, a bit of old technology. It's an Apple Time Capsule, 2TB edition. Uh, I've decided to pick one of these units up um, just because A, quite lazy at back in the data up on the Macs that I have here. And we've been increasing the number of Macs that we're starting to use, so a couple of iMacs, a couple of MacBook Pros, and really we need to make sure that the data we've got on these is actually getting backed up. As you can see, it's the standard sort of pretty box. There's the two terabytes there, just to let everybody know how much storage space we've actually got. And um, now it's just a case of opening the box. If we can figure out how to open the box, it's uh, the usual problem that I have with any Apple product is that they package it really well. And it just takes a wee bit of thinking to try and get it out. But uh, there we go. As you can see, designed by Apple in California, as usual. Uh, we just have to find the wee bit of tape there. Yep, yeah, let's cut that open. That says into that. And now we get to see what it is like. Yep, yeah, there we go. It, uh, typical Apple product, white with a logo and very, very heavy. A lot heavier than I thought it was going to be. Um, certainly a bit larger as well. So what else have we got in the box? We've got the power cord. And of course, we've got the standard pack which will be instructions yeah you can see yep oh and there's a cd as well so what we got backing up with time capsule time capsule setup guide yeah then we've got them all in different languages those we're discreetly thrown to one side and finally we've got the cd there um that will help us configure the thing up and that seems to be it that's all it's in the box so, okay, let's see about putting all the bits and pieces back. And um, yeah, check the back out there. On the ports, we've got the power and it's a USB ports. We've got four Cat5 ports there. Um, one there is actually a gigabit. That's the sort of main one. You would use that as the one port as well. Um, other than that, there's not much else to see. We'll take it out of the lovely wrapping that Apple puts in all of the products. And no doubt after a few seconds that was soon covered with fingerprints and all dirty. Yep, bit of dust already. But um, yeah, it's a nice looking device, quite a bit of a weight. All we've got to do now is see about uh, setting the thing up and uh, try all the Macs on. So really that's it. We have the device, we've got our setup guide, we've got the disc. That's all we need. Thanks for watching.